было. Well, hello there. Then again, it's the Americans that used to build gas for petrol. And they also call a game of played summer. Intense football. Life the stereotype base player who doesn't spend money on his brand or his equipment but spends it on new that too. I have never heard of that stereotype, not gonna lie. So yeah. But I guess it's just because like a lot of friends of mine are bassists, so I haven't heard of it. It's more of an American thing, yeah, thought so. Like, yeah, here the people just joke about, I think most of the time, how the basis never gets the girl or something like that. Is a thing there too? I just don't know why. Science, um, people keep saying that, yeah, the, what the fuck it's called, the bassist is the least important character of the band and all that, but no, it is not. A lot of things sound way better with bass. Way better. Bassist never gets a girl, I guess, do you? Yeah, well, to say that to me, Peter Steele, or Lenny, the Mr. Yeah, exactly. Like, I don't know where that stereotype has appeared from, you know? Don't really understand it at all. Like, who, who designed it? Who was like, yeah, that's, this is how it goes? Pretty sure that man got tons of girls. Mm -hmm. Yep. I have only heard that bases to get all the women. Hmm. I have never heard of that one. This is to get a bad reputation because a lot of guys get stuck playing games rather than choosing it as a first choice. Six six six. PC, seriously, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? Why? Love the deep bass and sound. Mm -hmm. I will show you the photo of you playing bass. No, you did not. I would have remembered it. Once you beat big badasses and clean out the moon base, you are supposed to win, aren't you? Aren't you? Where is your fat reward and ticket home? What the hell is this? It's not supposed to end this way. It stinks like rotten meat, but looks like the lost demon's base. Looks like you are stuck on the shores of hell. The only way out is true. To continue the Doom experience, play the shores of hell and its amazing sequel, Inferno. Lovely. Well, I guess we played the ending credits go hell, we played. Single player, new game, the shores of hell. The flesh. And I'm gonna go with the easy once again. I know I'm being boring, but at the same time, I just want a neat, very relaxing game experience today since the whole day has been way too fucked up. That leads to a lot of guys half assing it. Oftentimes, just a person it as a guitar but lower. Weird. Okay. 
<laughs> what is this? Oh, it's llama. Right. Or something. So I decided that it's a good thing to walk in it because it feels good. That is either blood or no lava. And I do hope that it's blood. So I got some feeling nice here from lava. Different verse for me. It's an Iron Maiden without the bass. Imagine any freaking darker music without the bass. Simply not. Mm -hmm. Okay, still more and more people are taking it seriously and recognize it as some soul for the retention is pursuing metal. I'm not sure, but I do feel like it has always been a thing in metal, but yeah, I could be wrong. Could be wrong big time. Oh no, this map, I remember this one. So this is why I have a feeling that the uh, tag first playthrough is probably gonna be there. Well, if it's gonna be there, then we'll pretend that it's first playthrough, I guess. Oh no. I've got the lava. We don't need to aim properly. We don't need to. What the fuck is the thing? Reload the gun. That is just non existent. We don't need to manually heal. We just need to buy the one healing bucket and that's it that's fucking warehouse level sucks i agree with you it does fucking suck i'm gonna punch you in the face Boop. It's always a thing in metal and guitar true music. People think that simply because the guitarist is pulling a freaking solos, he's all the good stuff. People don't realize the importance of bass. Hmm. Well, I have heard some bass solos as well. It's like people just tend to forget that they exist for some reason. I never understood what is appealing about Elaculas. You have disliked them since you first heard them play, play like 20 years ago. Not really. Into her music. But to be fair, isn't the, like everything has started to sound too light? Yes, I have started to felt like I need more and more music that is such as despair and sorrow and death. Even more to normally. No time to switch to Plutonia and get tortured. That, that, that was 
Good times. Good, good times in Plutonia. Ooh. Definitely fond memories of it. In the heart that the popular culture guitarist and drummer get joked about as being disposable in the band is kind of shitty. Yeah, which is like... If you think of it, it's easier probably to find someone who knows how to play guitar than a person who knows how to play uh, drums. Could be wrong, but the way lesser amount of people have who I have met that play something, most of them are guitarists. You do like Lapin Laden, Lin Lukdo. Same jokey music as Alakalas, but much sweeter. <laughs> there is now you have the photo of you playing the bass. Do I even dare to open that on stream? <laughs> Of course, not on my main monitor, more like if I check it during the stream, will I get scared or something? I don't know. No, please. Uh, no, there was a hidden joke about like making stupid faces or freezing or something. <laughs> but no, I would never open anyone's DMs on the freaking main monitor. No, I would never. That isn't my style. Unless if it goes into so stupid stuff. No, I would still not. No, still not. Even though there is indeed a big pile of uh, DMs that people have sent to me. Like, and no, it's, it's not something like, hey, I sent you something like you are nice or something I like you or something. No, no, no. Extremely, really random fucking DMs. Like, really fucking random DMs out of nowhere. Those I have piled on my PC's files. One of the recent ones was somebody sent me out of the blue. Uh, would I want to be there? What the fuck it's called? They wanted to be my sugar uh, daddy or something like that, and I was just looking at it like, this person doesn't even see my profile picture. Why the fuck they would say something like that? Totally legit. Totally legit. Random DMs are the best. <laughs> Don't offer any ideas. <laughs> Don't worry, Chicky. You haven't said anything that bad that I would have had to take any screenshots. So yeah, that kind of sets the bar high up. On that case. Weird DM breeding room, but when I have enough of them, I would say. Uh, there is also stuff like, randomly, out of nowhere, appears like, Are you thirsty? I got a lot of blood. It's like... What now? What? Like, we... Sure, you have gotten two DMs. You also got them a super current message. Just, just this past week, you got two women proposing me to be a super mama. Mm -hmm. It's always like, yeah, sure, you're legit. Mm -hmm, I believe you. So there are no misconceptions. You have actually only ever been cordial with queens and demons. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I think we have talked like one, two, maybe three times, and it's mostly, hey, look at this game. Thanks. Here is where you can download the. Ah! The Silent Hill demo. I've never understood super DMs or super love relationships. I'm not judging if somebody's having them, but I am not that type of a person. Hmm. 
possible. Like, I prefer getting money out of, you know, a job. Well, I guess it would be considered as a job as well. I don't really know. I haven't looked into that too much, but like... Prefer doing something and getting money out of that that I'm, for example, playing games or doing graphic designing or something. And not just because... Let me send you some pictures of the body parts or something. That just doesn't appeal for me. I'm not that kind of person. But if somebody else does it, you know, none of my damn business. If it works for them, you know, you just send her music and things. I wouldn't mind a sugar mama, but those are hard to come by. Aren't the people scared of diabetes? Oh, 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 and then the one of the like weird fucking DMs, L like a really weird fucking DMs that I actually got in the middle of stream one time. It's it's been a years ago, so I can talk about it. Um. Someone sent me in the middle of the stream message on the DMs. I can see my DMs most of the time during the stream because I have the chatbot open that shows even the DMs, so I can see them. So don't send me stupid bullshit while I'm streaming because, well, obviously then I can just look at it badly and be like, okay, can someone ban them or something? Uh, no, I'm joking. But there was someone who asked about could you open your jeans zipper and make the sound on the microphone and they would pay like a big amount of money out of it and i was like it was quite a big ton, uh, ton of money but i'm not doing that kind of stuff not at all so yeah i just verify my mods like hey this named person could you ban please never heard of them ever since but yeah i would say that's one of the definitely fucked up stuff that i have gotten and it's like ah, what the fuck hello to you too zipper buttons are so much better yeah they don't make sounds Sounds easy money, feel free to direct that kind of stuff to you. Yeah, sure. Gonna be like, well, I don't, but here, here is this, this person sent me. Oh, yeah. All kinds of lovely stuff. And I am sad that still a lot of other streamers go through that kind of stuff, even quite often. It's just like, why? What the fuck? Why? And then there are like far more worse stuff, which is even more like, what the fuck? That wasn't even creepy. I'm just saying, Zipper is an encourager. Sometimes you think there are the ones with their demise. Have I ever said anything against them? Does this lead anywhere? You see, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Thank you for the heart, I appreciate it. But yeah, um, most of the time, like, I just find humor out of that kind of stuff, and it's like uh, things that I will be laughing at. Because I don't really think there is anything else to be against it. Of course, you know, block those people, obviously. But also, like, uh, to survive it, just you can laugh at it and be like, ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho. There to mind? Well, so much you. <laughs> Hi, Krob. How are you today?
Wir fahren back from work and time for relax. Sounds quite a good. How was your work day, if you don't mind me asking? That fits queen somewhere. Freaking loose completely emote. I was like, what the fuck are you talking? Looking at it like, what the fuck? fuck? <laughs> Hi, Jaden Dot. How are you today? Your style today is even better than normally. Even though, like, today I felt even weirder than normally, so I really, really, really appreciate that science. Uh, I don't want more spiders in my hair! I don't want more of them there. So my hair is tied up. Got some uh, great times with spiders. And, like, there's dust and... Same with this all. Not even like a little bit insane, just a quite a pile of insane. Spider should pay rent if they want to live in your hair. Mm -hmm. If you don't know, no one has animals and all of that. <laughs> okay, that is that is pretty awesome. I really love your hairstyle. Thank you. It was okay, nothing special. Okay. Well, I would say that's good science if it would be like, yeah, it was a really bad. Then it would be like, oh. Best emote and it's not even close. <laughs> Still happy that that damn joke as I mean, a joke. <laughs> Emote that I made as a joke has brought so much happiness for people. No, I can hear the music. I might have to look into that PC stuff later on. Oh, no, I have to. This is the fight with my PC. Like, if the amount of stress wouldn't be so overwhelming as it is at the moment, I wouldn't mind to go through reinstalling Windows and all that. But. <gasps> Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. And hi Tana, how are you today? Yeah, if, if the amount of stress that I'm going through at the moment wouldn't be as high, I would be like, okay, time to reinstall Windows. No, it's gonna be fucked up, but we'll have to do it kind of thing. And now I'm just like, my PC does some weird shit and I'm like, don't do that today, thank you. Don't fucking do it. Do something else, please. Anything else? You open up PC and couple of spiders inside the screening here, but you're... Oh no. <laughs> I was actually worried of that, because I was... Is it called racking the leaves or something like that? Because um, I was trying to be a nice person. And like, that Yebuski would appreciate me as, you know... I, I don't know. I was just trying to be super nice, so I was like uh, getting rid of the leaves outside. Because I wanted to help uh, while he was at work, and well, obviously I didn't have anything else to do, so I thought that I lit some fire. Mm -hmm. So I went there and were getting rid of the leaves, and then I left my phone on the outside table because I thought, you know, I need to hear if somebody decides to call me. I don't know why the fuck would anyone call me, but you know, just in case. And then. 
the spiders. Where on my phone? <laughs> Hi, Becca. How are you today? Who's your favorite game ever? Hmm, you have a great taste of games, I see. So yeah, the spiders have been everywhere today, and I'm not happy about it. Not at all. Ignoring people calling me was a really empowering decision. People don't really call me that often, so most of the time if they call me it's a... Uh, emergency? But even if it would be emergency, they wouldn't call me, because why the fuck would they call me and not um, emergency number? So... That's, that's a very interesting question, right? But, like, people really, really, really rarely call me. So if it's uh, somebody calling, it's something super important. Except now when the renovation is going, yeah, there have been long calls. The spiders wanted to see if you had Spider-Man's number. Then, yeah. Fair. 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 Spiders. He was like spiders. Mm. Stop it now! Do, 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 do. Yes. That's exactly what was going on. Sorry, I couldn't take your call offering me a shitty job because spiders stole my cell phone. I have not gotten those calls like. <sighs> Even if the, somebody would call me like, hey, are you interested of this job? I would be like, well, if you want to explain my doctor or how the fuck am I at the job, I'm not gonna see me. Because I, I would probably be like, oh, you are offering me a job? Hell yeah! And then my doctor is calling them, listen, I'm supposed to be on a sick leave. But no, no one has called because we have that system where people like this, they don't even get your number. I don't fucking know. You mean when people start panicking, they do weird stuff. So someone calling you instead of a 112 would be, wouldn't be too weird. Mm, fair. Fair, fair. I would probably be the person who would start panicking that bad then. No. I would like to joke about it, but no. Hello, Goofa face. Isn't spiders stole your doctor's call? I wouldn't be surprised of that either. I'm sure of that. They have a conspiracy theory like conspiracy against me at this point you mean when you wait for you saying stuff again money have been away from team any kind of jobs I guess for five or six years now I don't really know anymore so it's like years become a blur at some point. So I've been quite a while. And you're back to making a track up of and you're and welcome back. And that's why you should always have a flamethrower with you. Yeah, but at the same time if I go outside with the flamethrower and you know the grass is Dry and I have flamethrower. I I don't think there is anything to 